Controversial new certification requirement for teachers is headed to a vote by the State Board of Education. The EdTPA exam comes as school districts across Texas are already struggling to find and keep teachers. Our Andrew Lamparski explains what this test could mean. If there's one issue that Texas educators can agree on, it's that we need more teachers. Districts are struggling to fill teacher vacancies right now. But critics say the problem could get even worse if the State Board of Education implements the Ed TPA exam. Our educators here in Texas are drowning and you're just adding water. Future educators would submit a portfolio, lesson plans, student teaching videos and reflection essays. But Baylor School of Education professor Suzanne Nesmith says grading those against a rubric is concerning. When you're looking at very standardized criteria for a very diverse set of circumstances, it could be very problematic. The TEA says the exam will have the opposite effect on the teacher shortage. So we don't believe that EdTPA is actually going to prevent teachers from entering and instead is actually going to make them better prepared and more likely to stay longer term. Still, the Texas State Teachers Association is asking the board to find another option. Nothing prepares you uh, for your classroom like your classroom. Uh, no, no set of students are the same, even from class period to class period. And just one score could mean another classroom without a teacher. This is one measure, and because it's so high stakes, if you don't pass it, then you cannot be certified. The Board of Education approved the initial proposal last week and will make a final decision on Ed TPA in June. Andrew Lamparski, 25 News. Andrew, thank you. The exam also comes with a $300 price tag. The TEA says it's working with the test vendor to offset that cost. The EDTPA test is accepted as part of certification in 18 states across the nation. As you can see, the states are from all over the country. The South, West Coast, Midwest, East Coast, Northeast. Depending on the state, some teachers can take the test and replace it over other parts of the certification process, while some states have that test required. And according to the TEA, there are currently five steps to become a Texas teacher. One, get a bachelor's degree, complete an educator preparation program. This could be an alternative certification program. Pass certification exams for your teaching subject. Submit a state application for certification. And lastly, pass a background check and fingerprinting.